Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, make sure you go and subscribe and click on the bell so you can get notified. I do hauls and I do daily vlogs. So make sure you subscribe so you can check out our daily life and then every once in a while, you'll see a Target haul or a Marshalls haul and we're going into the holidays and I'm not on a huge spending budget, but I do like to pick and choose what I get and they're pretty good finds. So make sure you go subscribe and click on the bell and then come and follow me around the store as we go shopping at Target for Christmas in the dollar spot. We're not in any other section of Target, we're just in the dollar spot. It's kind of where my budget is, but it's also where the good stuff is. Let's just be real, like that's where the good stuff is. Go subscribe, then follow me around the dollar spot. I actually had to go a couple times. I'm not gonna lie, we'll talk about that in a second. Go do that and then I'm gonna come back and we're gonna tell you what I got because I'm so excited. enjoyed that. I actually had to go to Target multiple times. I said a few times, but it was actually like five or six. Basically anytime I went to Target, I was checking at the dollar spot. So it was probably more than that, but our Target, I don't know if I'm just jumping the gun and I'm trying to get this stuff early. I don't know what the deal is, but they're not getting the stuff out on their shelves. They didn't last year either. And so I'm just, it was frustrating. So I went to a different Target today. So I went to one 20 minutes out of my way today because I wanted to find stuff that I knew that they were putting out for Christmas and I wasn't finding it mine and I found it. I found what I wanted, not everything that I wanted, but I did find some stuff. So let me show you what I got. When I first started going to the stores, I did find one thing that is super cute. You'll have to ignore my kids. They just got off their Zoom calls. So if you hear noise in the background, I can't make everyone be quiet. They're all, I have four kids if you're new. They're all home doing virtual school. So it doesn't leave a whole lot of room for <laughs> these one-on-one -on -one sit down videos of mine. So just know that I have children and it's life and I have to just let it be. So they might even sneak in here to ask for help with their math. It's a thing. Okay, the first thing that I got, and I'm actually gonna open them up, are these string lights. They were $3 and I always think these are a really good find. It's these old bulbs. Remember these when, I mean, they're, they're totally retro. It's from when I grew up, probably even before that, obviously, but they're little snow globes. Let me show you. Isn't this the cutest? Let me get you up close. So there's a tree and then there's snow. Like, I mean, you're obviously gonna, not gonna move these a ton, but like the 3D effect is just super cool. I just think this is gonna be so cute. Maybe I'll put some batteries in it so we can see them all lit up. So they're not very long. These string lights are not very long at all. But you guys, these work really good as a garland. Add this to like a different holiday swag, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy whatever, and this makes the perfect light up, kind of a backdrop for a garland. So I use these all the time. I also use them in like little tablescapes. You can put them in a tray, you can put them on your mantle. You can, I actually think I might use this one on my mantle. I might do greenery across my whole mantle, like I do. We live in the Northwest, so I have access to lots of greenery for free. I just step outside my house and I go cut it down. But I might put these on top of the greenery because they're super cute and it'll just kind of add to the effect. So I'm gonna put some battery in, batteries in these and then we'll see what they look like. I told you the kids would come in. Shut the door. 
<laughs> little kids. Look how cute. It's hard because I have, I'm right in front of a window. Wish you could see how cute they are lit up. Not really like when I hold it down here. Yeah, you know, I don't know. You're not gonna be able to see it because I need the light to be able to like film. But they're really, really cute. And my daughter just came in and saw them for the first time. And she just really likes them as well. So. Okay, so the next items, if you are new to my channel, I like to find things during a holiday that aren't, that aren't necessarily fully holiday, if that makes any sense. Because I like to utilize them for longer than the holiday. If I'm gonna put the money into them, maybe I wanna keep them up year round. And these three things that I got, actually it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine things I can use all year round. I'm so excited. I can make these to an extent, and I have made them before, but I can't do the final details on them like they are here. I mean, you know that I like houses if you are one of my followers. The 11.8% of you who are subscribed and are my followers, that percentage needs to go up. My friends, if you, if you watch and you're not subscribed, you should. But you know I love houses and you know I love wood, but these ones have windows. I mean, look how big it is. It's like as big as my head. And look at that one's even bigger. Like I, Jason saw him at Target today with me and he's like, okay, I'll go get a basket. <laughs> like of course you're gonna get those and I love to make now that I have collected a lot of these I do have them within like a lot of my decorations but now I'm kind of making I kind of want to do like a little tree or a house village I did a I don't know a couple year, last year or the year before I did a whole like tablescape that was houses and and then I put fake snow down and I put the little fake trees in there I make my I might make a whole table, like maybe my front table, into like a whole house village. And then I could put little characters, like it would be really fun. So I got this one, they're really big, and I got this one. These little ones, look, they're like the same, but they're little. <laughs> they're so stinking cute. Like I wish I had the ability to cut this kind of stuff out from the wood because I would totally make them myself. But they're so cute. Imagine putting like lights behind them and I kind of have them glow. I mean, for real. Okay, so then I had to get these ones because they're the little mini ones. I have one big black one and then a medium gray, a, couple, a lot of medium gray ones in like the bigger ones like this in the middle, in the metal medium ones. And then I have one gray one in this size. The reason why I like this size is because these ones work in tray. Like if you had a three tiered tray or a two tiered tray or a table tray, they work really good in that kind of a decoration because they're little, but they have a, a good impact. And these ones don't actually have like, they don't have a light that you can turn on, turn on. But what I might do, I had real candles that I put in my houses last year and the year before, and I would just go around my house and I would light them every night. But what I might do is try and just find those little tea light. Maybe I got some last year. Just the battery operated ones. Um, and then I can just flip them all on. But that is what I got. And like I said, I didn't get a lot of holiday stuff. If you wanna see the holiday stuff that I got from Hobby Lobby when I did that trip, I don't know, it was last week or the week before, I got some fun stuff with that and it's gonna be a whole separate like decorating video because um, we changed and added a theme to tree to our decorations for Christmas. And my daughter is gonna help me with that. So stick around because we're going into the holidays and I love decorating for Christmas and this year, because of COVID, if you're watching this in the future, like this is our only holiday like this year that we get like the full effect of Christmas. Like you can still have Christmas in your home and presents and unwrapping and the decorations build up that feeling of Christmas the entire month. So I want my kids to feel that holiday. They're home from school, they're home doing school. I want them to sit under the Christmas tree and do school. Like when can you ever do that? Like I want them to sit underneath the tree with the light and the decorations and the fireplace and feel Christmas all month long because they can. And so this is like the first holiday since COVID started that I felt like I want to decorate. So you're going to want to stick around and come back for more. That bell is your ticket. It'll tell you when I have videos and from now until Christmas, it's kind of game on. The tree is going to go up either right before Thanksgiving or right after. I haven't decided yet, but we're only a couple weeks away now from Thanksgiving. So <laughs> 
it's about to happen. But thank you guys for watching this little Christmas haul slash shopping at Target. Come back for more and we'll see you guys next time. Good night, goodbye, goodbye.